Now we are even being bombarded by the supernatural, by the cracker. So obviously he knows there's something out there and he can't keep, keep quiet about it, but he's trying to turn you around and stare you the other way. And he's doing that with the masses. But it doesn't matter because our nature is spiritual. So now going back to this, you must understand, no matter how black people express themselves, all of them will be saved. Because saving a person is not necessarily saving the physical body. And because we have a spirit, and that spirit is the same spirit of the most high creator, there's no way that that particular spirit can be damaged. That means if you think of, you think of yourself as God, but you'll also think about a creator that's over you. That's wrong thinking. What happened was is the creator, the original creator, the most high, who has a mother, but the original creator, which is a he, but he has a mother, which is the triple blackness of space that he came from. But he's the original creator of this universe beyond his mother. He just, what is the creative part of the universe, he created. In order to save you, he broke himself up into millions of crystals and came down in the earth and rested in the your human body. So, he can raise you up from the inside out, other than the outside in. So in actuality, you are the original creator because you have a piece of the original creator in you, which is the original creator. So a part of our therapy in Niggas Anonymous is we got to get out of, we have to get out of thinking that there's a God over us when the God that is over us is within us. You get it? Do you get the concept? So you got, ye are gods, but not only are ye gods, you are the divine creator who broke itself up into millions of pieces and settled in each one of you called dual light, -like, called melanin. You see what I'm saying? As above, so below. There is no thing in space and time and space. We're talking about right here and now, the unity. So you are the original creator. That means that you don't supposed to follow no one and nobody, especially no other motherfucker shitting in the toilet just like you. <laughs> that's the concept. Now, that's a heavy burden to carry. You know why? Because sometimes it's easier to believe in a God over us. Sometimes we can just pass everything away and say, oh, well, God's going to take care of it one day. But when you know the real truth, like Prince say, you own your own. In this life, you own your own. <laughs> Literally. And that's when the loneliness comes, but the path of spirituality is a lonely one. Especially when another other motherfuckers around you don't want to hear this shit. You see? But you are the original creator. That's some heavy shit to, to handle. You see what I'm saying? But it broke itself up into each crystal. Because it says that Humanity is nothing but the, the scattered crystals of light fell into darkness. But salvation is to gather back up those crystals into what? One unity. That's what I just read out of the Gnostic scriptures. Of one unity. And so you are the original creator. So as you think, so is it. Putting on the mind of God because you are God. 